Hey, welcome back to Play the Game with Steve. It is time for a revenge match. So last, my, on my last stream, I tried to play these characters with a janky mechanic where I was trying to uh, get Boom Boom to like stupid amounts of counters. Uh, and But I did play against the, uh, the Brotherhood with the Marauders and then it was okay, but I don't think it was, I planned my, 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 my thing out too much uh, because the Marauders do have all these crazy abilities as well. So it kind of nerfed what I was trying to do. So on that note, on that note though, I still got managed to pull it off. So if you haven't seen that stream, you can go check it out. It was pretty fun. I want to give a big shout out to the channel members, all the people that support the channel financially. I really appreciate that. Uh, I want to take a big thank you as well to all the subscribers. And if you're new to this channel and you want to see some awesome content and some gameplay of Marvel Champions, well, make sure to subscribe and put that notification up whenever new stuff is released. So you'll always be up to date with my latest shenanigans. All right. Uh, so uh, I revised my decks. And this is, again, what I talk about a lot in Marvel Champions and I try to promote a lot in this channel is strategize and adapt. So if you face off a scenario and you want to give yourself a level of difficulty, which I did uh, playing the Brotherhood. And again, now this one, I'm going to, I really want to, I want to, because I got beat up last time, I want to revenge and I want to beat up all four of these characters. So it might be a little bit longer game. It shouldn't be too long because once you take out the first one, the other three kind of just fall like dominoes because you, uh, you have everything. So, uh, so I did modify my decks a little bit to make sure that I was uh, more prepared to face off the challenges. All right, so Storm uh, is still an aggression, so I still kept the aggression deck. I put the two powers of aggression and the three double resources for my resources cards. Uh, I did add more events, so I added two piercing strikes, one relentless assault, and three into the phrase uh, to add with threat removal. And I also added a dive bomb because she's aerial, and it's a big seven damage attack, so we can do some fun times with that, especially that we are aerial. Uh, as far as resource cards, we added an X jet for extra resources. Uh, we added Death Focus and X Gene. So these are all cards that are going to help pay for our stuff. And we added two martial prowesses, one for each character, uh, because both Rogue and Storm have some nice attack events. So we want to put that through. Uh, I do want to focus a little bit on the overkill. So I added two follow throughs to my deck and three marks. So that means when I'm punching minions, uh, I will be able to, even if I go basic attacks, all the attacks are going to gain overkill. Rather it be with my Into the Phrase or my Dive Bombs or Relentless Assault. Uh, the overkill is always going to trigger, which is super fun. Now to enhance that, I added two allies. I have Wolverine and a Throg, uh, just because there might be a little bit of minions. And for Wolverine, I also added a Sidearm. So... This is my deck. So then at, Wolver at the end, Wolverine can have four, maybe five attack. And I think one of them uh, of those things gives a plus one attack. So I might be able to get Wolverine up to six attack with ranged uh, and piercing. So that is going to be super legit. So that is the deck for Storm. And then we're going to shuffle these up in a minute. And then we are going to shuffle everything. I'm going to press pause so I can shuffle everything up. Uh, then for Rogue... Uh, and, then I'll, and then I'll start playing. So for Rogue, uh, <clears throat> again, we're going to build the protection build. Uh, so we have the three double resources, uh, the Ms. Marvel ones. So thank you again to Dragon Lord, I think, or Eric. I can't forget who gave them to me. But again, uh, I really appreciate that you did that. I have the built support and the specialized training. Built support is going to be help to get the X-Jet for uh, Storm and the Quinn Carrier for me as resources. So we have it here. Uh, specialized training, we're probably gonna get the frontline specialist for Rogue because I want her at max HP because I wanna be able to give her a Dauntless. And then surveillance specialist for Aurora just so she can thwart for three and then ready so she can do some fun things. We have Utopia, so when X-Men allies interplay, there's not gonna be a lot of that, but it's always a fun ready when it does happen because I do have Nightcrawler in this deck. I have a med team because I want to heal Wolverine faster. I need him. I need him to heal a lot faster because that's it. But uh, talking about Wolverine, we do have two honorary X Men's and a protective training. So probably one's going to go on Wolverine just to try to bring his health up to eight, so I can get four activations out of him, maybe more if everything goes wood. Uh, then I have the Dauntless for me. So as soon as I go past 
uh, the uh, as soon as I go past my max health, uh, it's going to be super fun because then when I play cards like Going Rogue, if I have Retaliate, and this is a static, that's why she's so good in protection, she can always get the Retaliate without having to touch the villain. I can confuse and I can stun with my two uh, uh, my two big events. That is super legit. And then because I'm pairing off with Storm, uh, Storm when she has her crown and her cape, uh, or there was just a cape, she becomes aerial and I get stalwart if I touch her. So I get all three. So that, that's the, the goal of this deck is to always be able to trigger the Southern Cross and the Going Rogues and get all three benefits. We have the Unflappables because she has her a Bulletproof Bell and she has her Flash Freeze. Those are both defense events. So if I can get some extra card draw from that, and it's always death fitting. Uh, then for extra insurance, uh, uh, for extra uh, resources, we have the death focus and X gene, which are gonna pay for our powers. Uh, we have two endurances, one for each, again, max health. We have Sorcerer Supreme and Symbiotsu. And to get the Sorcerer Supreme, we have Clea and Brother Voodoo. Uh, to recur our Bulletproof Bells, we have Jocasta. And then as X-Men characters, we have Nightcrawler and Polaris, and she has Gambit as well. So there's three X-Men allies that can kind of play off of uh, her strategy here. So that is the decks in a nutshell. And Rogue, once she has the Symbiote Suit and the um, Sorcerer Supreme, she'll be able to go up to eight. So I'm gonna shuffle up. And let's play. All right, we are ready to face off. You saw the new decks. And now, this is what we do. We're gonna kick some butt. No more shenanigans. No more anything. Just straight up punchy, punchy, punchy. All right, so first things first, the Brotherhood Strikes is gonna get this. Then we're gonna get our minion, our villain. He's between 32 and 36. So let's see what villain we're gonna face. We're facing off against Avalanche. So Avalanche is after Avalanche attacks you, exhaust an ally. So that doesn't matter if he damages you or anything. As soon as he attacks you, you defend, uh, you exhaust an ally. So that's a little unfortunate if we're building ally strategies, which we're not. Uh, only Wolverine in here is gonna be sad. So we're gonna have to take him out fast. He's got, oh, and he's got 36. And then we're starting at Everyone gains steady. So that's the easiest one. So that's really good. So we got this. Okay, we're going to shuffle our decks. Ro uh, Storm's going to go first. All right. So Storm and then Rogue. Oh, these cards are just jumping out of here. All right, here we go. So we got our help pool, we got this, we got our touched. I'll just put this here. All right, let's see what we get. Double piercing strike, which is not bad. Oh, we got our garden. Oh, yes, the cape. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and a death focus. Oh my God. Well, it looks like it's pretty much going to be a cape into a death focus. Uh, yeah, that's probably Storm's turn. I have an extra resource, so maybe I'll pitch two cards and try to find not what I'm looking for. I was trying to find maybe a weather change or something like that, but all right. And I'm going to choose the weather to be, uh, let's just put it as the plus one attack. All right. All right. And then Rogue gets... Specialized training, bulletproof, two, four. Oh, we have build support. Oh, we're, ooh, that might change stuff. Oh, yes. I have a torrential rain. Oh, no. What, what did I, oh, there's my death focus. Oh, shoot, I'd be short one. Rats. For the cloak, the death focus. Oh, if I could get rid of six threat, I could play this four five, an energy transfer. Hmm. But I don't have the other one that I need. Uh, okay, okay, okay. We'll see how that plays out. Energy transfer allows me to ready, so she can tour for two for four. 
she can't thwart at all. So I'd be one short. Rats, rats. Okay. And then I could bulletproof bell. Okay. Are we changing this? If I can find a going rogue, I can get rid of it. And then we each get extra resources. All right. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get rid of energy transfer, specialized training. I'll keep Polaris just in case. Oh, and I did get it. Nice. 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 All right. So we have the going rogue. We have. All right. Perfect. And I need to be aerial. And if I'm stalwart, I get to draw a card. So three, four, five. But then I lose my build support. Oh, no. All right. Decisions. What are we going to do? All right. Here we go. Uh, there we go. Storm. Storm, a storm, a stormer. Unless I don't play. Ah, oh, rats. So many choices. Okay, who am I sacrificing something for? Okay, uh, Storm's gonna flip. Uh, she's gonna punch off the tough. Uh, I'm gonna spend three to play the cape. I'll use Aurora, Aurora, Aurora's Garden to play the Death Focus. Um, oh no, I'll make it into the clear skies. I'll change the weather to clear skies. I'll get to ready and draw a card. It's a double. Oh, of course it's a double. All right. And then I will wait. All right. So that means I don't need the going rogue, which is awesome. Cause then I can play Polaris and then give her this. All right. Rogue is going to go up. I'm going to touch Avalanche because I have a bulletproof bell that I don't want to spend. I'm going to spend going rogue to play build support. Oh, wait. Yeah. Oh, I'm still short one. All right. I'm, oh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm not. Oh, no. Okay. Um, uh, I'm going to spend three to play Polaris and I will give Stormy tough. Polaris will thwart for one, bring it down to five. Uh, Rogue will thwart for two, we'll bring it down to three. I'll call for an action using Torrential Rain. Remove three threat, get rid of build support. And she's going to go get the X-Jet. Oh, that's so good on turn one. Oh, man. Getting rid of that and then getting that on turn one is just magical. So now we have... See, now she has two extra resources. And then I will go get the Quinn Carrier and just put it into play without having to be an X-Man. Or an Avenger, that's so good. That's an extra resource every time. Two planes, man, for six threat, two train, two trains. Amazing. And I think my camera just let go for some reason. All right. Uh, ba -ba -bum. That's done, that's done. I have two extra resources, which I can't do anything with. Polaris took a damage. And then we're good. All right, there you go, it's back. All right, camera. All right, so let's ready up. Let's ready up. Storm could have removed the threat on, yeah, that was dumb. So she would have removed one more threat. All right, here we go. We got Polaris here. We have Bulletproof Bell. All right, one, two, four, five. We have the Unflappable, which is great. Storm gets five. Ooh, two doubles. And I'm marked. All right, so if you start getting some uh, some dudes, this is good. Okay. Uh, we're adding two threats to the main. That goes to three. Avalanche is going to attack and storm for five. Uh, 
Avalanche is going to attack here. I'm just going to defend with Polaris because I'm going to have to exhaust her anyway. Plus three. Thank you, Polaris. And then I have the Bulletproof Bell, which is going to do some stuff. Claustrophobia. Oh, already. Sweet. Uh, Vertigo. Does nothing. Blobbers. And Riptide. All right. So plenty of dudes and then we pass it over here we're going to call for an alter you action and then we're going to get rid of claustrophobia with storm all right rogers rogers what do you want to do rogue uh rogue's going to use the queen carrier to play unflappable and i think i'm going to spend three to play nightcrawler uh, he's got patrol, so we're going to punch for four. Take him out. Uh, place two to it on the main scheme, one to it on each side scheme. Yeah, let's just take Riptide out. Uh, and then let's touch the villain again. He takes one. All right, Storm. What is Storm going to do? All right. Uh, Storm's going to flip up. We're going to change the weather. Uh, let's go into the thunderstorm. Are we, trying, are we are you changing it to the thunderstorm, Steve? Are you? I get to ready. I get to punch for a bit more. He can punch for three. She attacks for zero and then stuns a character. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we're just going to go to thunderstorm. <laughs> Deal two damage to Blobbers. We're going to ready with our cape. Uh, we'll use Power of Aggression for a Martial Prowess. More resources. Actually, uh, do I want to give the Martial Prowess? I think I'm going to give it to Rogue right now. I'm going to spend two to play Throg, who comes in with a tough... And I will mark Blobbers. All right. So he can punch for three. She can punch for three. And I didn't even need my resources. So Storm punches for three. Brings this guy to... You know what? I'm not going to mark. I'm going to mark her. And then Trog can just take him out. And then nothing happened, nothing happened. All right, here we go. And now with the Bulletproof, we're going to be good. All right, there we go. Two, four, five, and energy transfer. Nice. All right, Storm. Two, there's the end of the fray. Two, four, five, <laughs> Awesome sauce. Okay, here we go. Uh, we're going to add two threat. This is going to go to five. Avalanche is attacking us for five. We're going to use our Quinn Carrier to do a bulletproof bell. So we're going to get attacked for four, five, six, seven. We take no damage. We have to exhaust an ally. We trigger on flappable. We draw an extra card. Uh, now we're tough. We also have Retaliate, so 35. Uh, then he, Avalanche, wants to attack into Storm. Uh, I think Storm. Do I have a Lightning? I do have the Lightning. Yeah, I think I'll just do it like that. All right. So he's going to attack into Storm. I'll spend the energy transfer. So he's going to attack Storm for five. And I'll bounce Nightcrawler. She has to exhaust an ally. She's going to take one damage, go to nine, and get stunned. Or actually, stun a character. Stun a character. I'll stun Trog. And then two encounter cards. First one is, of course, Shadow of the Past. All right, it's undeniable that card's coming every time. Da 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 da. 
It's not unusual to see that on any time. But -da 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 -da. it's on a dot a game if I don't get the shadows. We're turn two here. It's not unusual to see that card every time. All right, so that is going to go to four and an acceleration. And then we put that card in our deck. All right, and then Mystique comes in with tough and villainous. And then we get under fire, because why not? Uh, protect the students and immovable. Go get blobbers again. All right. So sixth threat here. All right, passing it over here. Um, all right, storm. So we need to get rid of of threat off the main, off the protect the students. Okay, so if I call for an action, all right, let's go. Let's go here. Um, Storm is going to remove one threat here. Then I'm going to change the weather to the clear skies. So nobody's stunned. Uh, she gets to ready. Draw a card. There's another weather goddess. All right, cool. I'll be able to change the weather again. So I'm going to use weather goddess. I'm going to change the weather to the hurricane, which will remove two threat here. This is gonna go to three. All right. Uh, then let's mark. I have a def focus, X gene, X jet. All right. Uh, we're gonna go mark Blobber. Are we marking Blob? Are we getting rid of Mystique? I think Mystique can stay for now. Okay, uh, we're gonna mark. We're just marking Blob. And then we have the extra resources here. We're not playing our follow throughs, which is kind of sad, but it's okay. It's all right, all right. Cause we'll move in mysterious ways, darling. All right, does, okay, so she can do two damage. Okay, let's call for an action. Let's use rats. It's not an attack, rats. Okay, let's use Nightcrawler and Southern Cross. Nightcrawler, Southern Cross to do Going Rogue. Um, oh, who am I touching? All right, I'm going to go touch. Well, if I touch the main, the villain again, I think I will. I will keep touching the villain. So I'll remove three threat from the, the, the protect the students. And I will confuse. I will confuse Avalanche. That's I'm still calling an action here. I do get to search for an ally. I'll go get Clea. And then I'll play Clea. So if I get my Sorcerer Supreme, then I'm good. All right, so that's still not your turn, Rogue. So you can't do anything here. Okay. Storm. What does Stormy, 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 Stormy want to do? Uh, Storm is going to punch for two on Vertigo's. And then she's going to take a Retaliate, go down to eight. And then she's going to go one, two, three. And then into the fray. So two damage. So four damage is going on Avalanche. She's down to 31. And then I'll remove four threat from the main. That's going to go down to one. Vertigo is out. This has been played. 
And then, and then, and then, do I change the weather? Do I change the weather to plus one attack? I think I do. I'm going to change the weather back to the thunderstorm. And I'll deal two damage. Yeah, I'll deal two damage to Mystique. And then Storm will flip down. I'm going to spend Utopia and Endurance to play Clea. Uh, then we're punching for three. Yeah. Three, four, five. So there's going to be one left on Mystique. So we're going to punch for three, four, five. And Clea is going to take one. And that's it. All right, here we go. Let's ready our cards. Six here, two, four, five, and six. Ah, oh, nice, we have the marked into the fray and the XG. Nice, and then the lightning bolt too, so we can definitely do a lot of dinos on our turn. All right, and then we have five here. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and the Southern Cross. Nice. So we haven't found our, what are the, the one we're looking for. So this is going to go one plus three is going to go to four. Oh no, all oh, characters gain steady. Oh, Stevie, Stevie, Stevie. He's not confused. He's only half confused. Mm, did I mess up at the beginning? No, I haven't messed up yet. Uh, all right. Only half confused. All right, so he is going to scheme for two plus nothing. So that's uh, six plus one is seven. Uh, he wants to attack into rogue. Uh, you know what? Rogue's just gonna. How do I defend this and lose? Mm. Yeah, rogue's just gonna defend so I can draw an extra card. So for six. I'm going to lose my tough. I do have the retaliate because I'm touching the villain. I draw a card from a flappable. Uh -huh, there's my jacket. Nice. I'm going to take one, two here. Uh, go down to nine. Retaliate. Take out Mystique. Oh, wait. One, two, three, Steve. Go down to eight, take out Mystique, and then I have to exhaust an ally because of that. And then encounter, encounter, bound by business, find a dude, pyromaniac, find pyro. All right, going pretty well. Let's go find pyro. Two advances in the same turn. Ooh, toad, avalanche, pyro. There we go. Sweet, sweet, sweet. All right, passing it back to Rogakins. All right, Rogue is going to uh, use the Quinn Carrier for one to play her jacket. Um, do I want to give my guy Retaliate? Uh, I think what I'm going to do, uh, if I touch a minion, my attack gains overkill. All right. So my attacks are going to gain overkill. So I'm going to spend one, two, three martial prowess and a genius to do a southern cross. And I don't have aerial. So I'll do six damage. I don't have retaliate. What do I get? All right, so I don't get any bonuses unless I change the weather or I wait to change the weather. But then I won't be able to play anything anyway, so it don't matter. All right, we're gonna just punch Pyro for six. So two is gonna go on the boss. He's gonna go down to 28. He gets defeated. Um, I'm going to ask to use the X-Jet to play a Def Focus, Super Power to play an Endurance, 
Look at Rogue go. She goes back to 11. And then I think Rogue's going to, are we flipping? Yeah, we're gonna flip down with Rogue. So we can get our six cards, maybe get our Sorcerer Supreme. All right. Our Ra 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 is gonna flip up. Uh, Throg is going to punch. Uh, punch for three. On Blobikins. Oh shoot! I was I would I would have used the mark to play the X gene. Sorry, while I was an alter ego. All right. Uh, and then I could use into the fray here, which is. I'll lose, oh, wait, I lose, no. <laughs> so I don't have the chance, I'll have to, okay, so he's only half confused too. I don't wanna lose my flash freeze, but I think I have to. All right, Rogue is gonna punch, uh, Storm's gonna punch for three. And then I am going to go one, two, three to do an into the fray off of him. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six into the fray. I will kill him and remove five extra threat. Uh, sorry, flash freeze. I'll change the weather. Uh, let's put it on the hurricane. We'll put it on the hurricane uh, already. Already her. And then let's remove. We have Throg. We can't do this. We can do this. All right. We'll just punch for two. We'll take a retaliate. Go down to seven. And then Blob can just die on our turn. Unfortunately, we won't be able to trigger the other one that we want. What was he doing? Ah, oh, plus attack. No, he was get a plus three attack. That's not good. All right. Oh, Wolverine. Yes. Oh, we have the flash freeze. Darn it. All right. Well, we can use the flash freeze and then the X jet. We can play down Wolverine and then we're good. All right. And then Rogue is so set up. It's going to go fast from now on. Two, three, four, five, and six. Oh, oh yes, and Storm plays first. Nice, nice, because then I can put the protective training on Wolverine. Oh, yes, 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 yes. So still no Sorcerer Supreme, but that's okay. Uh, adding three, so that goes to five. Scheming for three, it goes to eight. Uh, attacking into Throg. Attach this to him. All right, done. He gets plus five and a tough. Attach this card to it and give it a tough. All right, so I'm going to get attacked for two. Ouch. Go down to five. I retaliate the tough away. Get stunned. Encounter, encounter. Brotherhood beat down, so I get stunned and exhaust your identity. Yay! Stun and exhaust. And an assault. Ah, oh, crap. Alright, well, Clea's gonna have to bite the bullet. Plus three. That was that was imminent death. Alright, so I still have alright. Sorcerer Supreme and I got all my mystics are still in here, so. And that's what it says, right? After Clea is defeated, Clea is defeated, shuffle her back into her deck. All right, there you go. Done, done, done. All right, we're at just about 30 minutes. All right, we're, we're doing, we're working here. We're working. Two, four, six. One, two, three, four, five. So maybe I'll keep 
this to bring this threat down. Use, yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. All right, playing into Wolverine. All right, Storm. Stormy, Stormy. What do we do, Stormy McWormy? Let's change the weather. You know what? Who needs a confuse? Uh, let's um, let's thwart for one off of Mystique's manipulation. Actually, let's just thwart for one off the main, since we can. Uh, and then we're gonna spend one, two, three, and the X Jet for four. Wolverine, schmuck. All right, Wolverine's coming in, and then we're gonna change the weather to the clear skies. Uh, clear skies. We're gonna ready storm. Get rid of all the status effects. All right, with the cape. Oh wait. Oh uh, wait. Before I do that. Before I do that. I was on the hurricane. So before that, I would, <laughs> this is what happens when you play too fast. Before I go to the hurricane, I will use. X gene and death focus to do torrential rain. I'll remove five threat from the main scheme. Then I will change it to the clear skies and draw a card. It's a sidearm. Oh, I'm still keeping that. And then she can punch for two. So that is, so he's at seven out of 11. Man, he's got a lot of higher health. All right, so we're gonna go down to Alter Ego. We're gonna keep this, because now we have a lot of control here. I don't think we have any chances of losing, not even the main scheme. All right, you, babe, I got you, babe. All right, and then we're gonna, Wolverine is going to slash for three. Uh, so that is gonna make it 10 out of 11. All right, Rogue's gonna flip up. Uh, Rogue is going to, since I had the bulletproof bell, touch the villain. All right, I am going to use Martial Prowess, X Gene, and Superpower Adaptation to do a Southern Cross. Uh, I get to stun that enemy, doesn't really matter because I'm just gonna deal six damage so one and then five on him. So he's down to 23. This guy goes away. This goes away. This goes here. Wolverine took two. I'm going to use unflappable. Actually, I'm going to use honorary X-Men. No, I can't. I have to do it like this. Unflappable. Protective training. So Wolverine gets... Plus three hit points, so he's got seven hit points. I'm gonna put an honorary X-Men on myself. So to go to 12, and I have my bulletproof bell, and that is good. So I'm touching the villain. I put Rogue's jacket on then, okay. But that's what I was gonna do. All right, so I'll keep my bulletproof bell, two, three, four, and five. All right, so we have a Mystic, nice. And we have the X-Gene and this, so we have all the resources we need. And then we have the gun. So Wolverine's gonna just start slashing for four, ignoring retaliates, so two, four, five, and six. Finally, we get our crown, and then we are off to the races with Storm that can just finish off and build here we go. We're adding three threat, so that's going back to five. Uh, he is going to scheme for... Uh, it's him, so he's going to scheme for three. That's going to go to eight. Exhaust a character. It's going to be her. Um, I'm going to get attacked. I'm going to use... The reason I can't use Death Focus is Death Focus is a hero action. That's why I can't use it to do my Bulletproof Bell. So I'll use the X-Gene for Bulletproof Bell. I'll prevent all the damage and get it tough. I do retaliate, he's down to 22. I get the draw, there's Jocasta, nice. 
All right, this is going to be easy. It's going to go one, two. It's going to be one, two, three. Uh, Bride of Voodoo into another card to maybe flip down, get the X gene. Nice. Okay, and then so that happened. Retaliate happened. And then two encounter cards. Mutant Terrorist. Let's go get that side scheme, Brotherhood of Mutants. Uh, is it in here? Is it in here? Nope. And uh, of course the Brotherhood is here. Uh, and that has seven threat, so that's always annoying. And then I get the Toad. And then what does Toad do? Each Brotherhood minion gains Quick Strike. And this one says, after Toad attacks and damages a character you control, discard a card at random from your hand. So he will not be damaging me because I have a tough and I retaliate on him. So that's seven. All right, here we go. Passing it over to Rogakins. Okay. I'm going to spend one, two, three. I'm going to play Brother Voodoo. I get to look for an event. Two, three, four, five. So no events. I had one left. So next turn, I'm 100% getting my Sorcerer Supreme, which is good. Um, I'm going to go touch... Brother Voodoo, and then between me and Brother Voodoo, we will remove five threat from the Brotherhood. So that's at eight, so that's a little dangerous. Brother Voodoo takes two. I'll keep my X gene. Do I go down? I think I will go down. All right, I'll go down so I can play my X gene next turn. And I am an X man, so if she doesn't need it. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, I'll spend this for an X-Man character. And then I'll play the X-Gene. Alright, so we got resources for days. We got extra health for days. And then Rogue is going to be all set up to do her, her thingamabobber. Alright. Alright. We're going to use Blast of Wind to play a sidearm on Wolverine, who also heals for one. He's going to slash for four, taking out this clown. Actually, you can just slash for four on the boss, bringing him down to 18. And dealing two damage to himself. Storm is going to flip. And then we're going to... This is an item, right? Alright, so I'm going to spend two to play Storm's Crown. Uh, then I'm going to change the weather into the hurricane. That will remove two threat. Let's get rid of the Brotherhood. All right. I do have an extra resource. Oh wait, I do have an extra resource. Oh no, but I needed it for, for this. So I'm gonna spend X gene and death focus. I'm gonna do torrential rain. I'll remove five threat. Storm will remove, will punch uh, the toad for two and take him out. Seems legit. Too legit. Too legit to quit. All right, we're going to get a bunch of encounter cards here, so this is going to be fun. Uh, I think both decks are decking out. So one, two, there's a dive bomb. Uh, and then, wait, I think she gets a card first. Then he gets a card. Rogue has too many cards. All right, resource, 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 resource. Card draw, jacket. Here we go. And we could get rid of Brother Voodoo because we'll have Clea as well. So one, two, shuffle. We might lose the main scheme here, which is kind of sad, but 
I was hoping to keep it on the main. But if I get rid of the everyone gets steady now, I'm not too worried because then I can just kind of stun confuse lock in now. So two, four, and five. We have the mark. We have the piercing. All right, we're good. We're good. And then one, two, three, four, five, and six. So misled is in my hand. Uh, I had two threat, so that goes to five. And then I shuffle. So I do have the resources, uh, so I can just, I really want the Dauntless too. All right, so let's say X gene, this place Clea. I'm still gonna be short one. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Maybe I don't play the Sorcerer Supreme this turn. All right, it's always a possibility. We'll see. Uh, here we go. We're adding three threats, so that's going to go to eight. He's going to scheme for two, three. Uh, eight's going to go to 11 out of 14. Uh, then he wants to attack. Uh, oh, if I keep Brother Voodoo, I can play all the cards I want. All right. So Storm's going to get attacked for four. Does she have defense? Oh, she's only at five. Ugh. Okay. So for five, boom, takes out Brother Voodoo. I don't have an ally to exhaust. Double, double, let's see what we get. Ground Swell, so he's gonna activate. So two, three, uh, that's gonna go to 14, which is gonna pop. And then we go into a different area, which I, I figured we would. Uh, each character gets plus one attack. Ugh, that's not good. And then advance, bound by business. It's harpoon, doesn't do anything. Please don't attack me. Deadly touch, two threat on the main. And this guy gets a tough and plus five. All right. Uh, passing it over to Storm, who heals Wolverine for one. All right. I got the piercing strike. Okay, he's got 18. We got to get rid of this clown. All right, let's go mark him. Let's start by marking him. Uh, let's spend... Let's spend the two to put a follow-through. Let's, let's build up, let's build up our, our Storm character. Uh, let's work for two. Um, Death Focus and X Gene are going to do Torrential Rain. We'll remove three threat. Mystique's Manipulation go down to one. And then two threat from the main because of the weather. And are we going to go to attack foes? Oh, man, if I go there, he's punching for six. That is craziness. Yeah, let's do that. Let's uh, change the weather. And we're going to go on to the thunderstorm. Uh, yeah, so thunderstorm is going to deal two damage to harpoon. He has 10 health. Do I have a big punch? I don't have a big punch yet. Okay, so what do we do? We got the misled we don't want. We have the X gene. We have the Storm's crown. All right, Storm's going to punch for four. Are we just punching Harpoon? Take two indirect damage. Can we get rid of Avalanche? That's the question. If we get rid of Avalanche, that's 10 damage. He's got eight left. Hmm, it'd be close. It'd be very close. I could remove, I don't need to remove threat. Rats. All right, we're going to punch with Wolverine for six. 
Yeah, we'll do six damage here. Um, this guy, Wolverine, still has seven health, so that's good. So he, he's still healing. All right, we're going to use Gambit and going... No, we're going to use X-Gene, Queen Carrier to play Clea. Rogue is going to flip up. She's going to touch Clea. So now I'm a Mystic. I'll use Gambit. And going rogue to do the Sorcerer Supreme. So that's extra cards. All right, now I can thwart for three, but there's nothing to really thwart. And I can't spend the Dauntless, and it's a condition, so I can't get it. Um, she's, she's punching for four. And she's punching for three. All right. Uh, so she punches for three. Brings him to nine out of ten. She takes a hit. And then she punches for four. So one and three on him. He's down to 15. All right. And then he dies. And I'll discard the misled. And that's it for now. I might have to lose Wolverine here. Because uh, she's attacking for six. <laughs> attacking for six, baby. That's a lot. And I really need to heal Roro. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so we got the Torrential Rain. We got the Flash Freeze. Uh, which could help. It does remove three to his attack. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. One, two, three, four, and five. All right. So we'll be able to confuse him next turn. All right. I think we can just defend with Rogue. Uh, and then defend with Clea. All right. Here we go. Uh, we're going to add three threat to the main. Avalanche is attacking into Clea. For six, Clea is going to get shuffled back in. Rogue ain't touching nobody. Rogue's going to defend for two. He's attacking for six. For eight, so I take six, go down to six. And encounter, encounter. Uh, each Marauder, okay, so there's how many mutants? X-Men, one, two, three, so that goes to six. And Surge into a gang up, oh crap. Uh-oh, all right, I think we have to do it. Storm, when the villain attacks you, All right, so she's gonna defend for two using the X gene to do a flash freeze. So I'm gonna, so it's minus five. So he's attacking for six, minus five, so one. She takes one, goes down to four. I have to exhaust Wolverine. All right, and then I get my first acceleration. Everybody got exhausted this time. All right, back to Rogue. Okay. Um, let's set, let's uh, let's call for some actions here. Let's use let's let's remove all the threats. Yeah, let's just do that. Uh, we're gonna call for an action. What do we want to do? Let's go to the hurricane. Yeah, we're gonna go on the hurricane. No, yeah, we're gonna 
Change up the weather, go to the hurricane. Each character gains retaliate. She gets ready and I get to remove two threat. Let's just remove six is gonna go down to four. Wolverine does heal for one though. All right. Uh, she is then going to use piercing strike and wait. One and two to play Throg, who does not have uh, who does not have a tough. So he's going to thwart for one off the mutant slayers. If I take one, I'm going to use the X Jet and Death Focus to torrential rain. I'll remove three from mutant slayers. I'll remove two from the main. That's done. Uh, Storm will thwart. Oh, and then she has to stay alive. She has to stay up. And then she'll going to throw Mystique's Manipulations. And then I'll go get a copy of Misled. And shuffle it into my deck. All right. Before you go down... Okay, before, before, before she goes down, I'm going to touch her and call for actions. All right, the first thing I'm going to do, Death Focus and X-Gene, I'm going to do a Going Rogue. I have Stalwart and Ariel. I don't have Retaliate. Oh, wait, wait. I'm going to spend two to do Energy Transfer. I don't know if I have Ariel until the end of the turn. Uh, how does this work again? Uh, uh, you gain each of the attached traits until the end of the round. Oh, there you go. So I do, I will keep, I will, but I'm no longer stalwart though. But I will, I will be Ariel. And I will have retaliate because I'm touching the villain. So now I can do, uh, and then I heal for two, go to eight. I get to ready, deal two damage to him. He's down to 13. I'm going to use Quinn Carrier and Super Absorbing Power to do going rogue. Uh, because I have retaliate, I will confuse. And I will remove three threats. So I'll just finish off whatever's on the main. I will use Honorary X-Men to do Dauntless. And I think I forgot to draw an extra card because I should have six. One, two, three, four, five. I did forget to draw six cards. Yeah, because that was my hand. One, two, three, four, five. So I should have one more. I, there you go. So I got a bulletproof bell for next turn. Okay, it doesn't matter. Uh, I am going to... I'm at how much health? Eight. Okay. Mm I will punch. Might as well. I'm just punching for three. Yeah, I'm going to punch for three, bring him down to ten. We need to kill him. He's the hardest. The first one's always the hardest one to kill. Once they're done, once the first one goes down, the other ones go down pretty simple after that. I don't have any allies. We're good. Oh, yes. And then I would have went down with Storm before. All right. So two, four, five, and six. All right. So we're into the fray. Lightning bolt. All right. So he's 100% dead. And then Wolverine will be able to slash through the next guy. And then she'll be able to recover. <laughs> I just need my garden. I'm just looking for my garden. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, nice. All right. Here we go. Uh, adding three threat. Uh, he's going to attack X Gene for a bulletproof bell. He can attack me for four. Oh, and I have Retaliate 2, 5. I have Retaliate 2. He goes down to 8. I took no damage. I get a tough. And I draw a card with the Unflappable. 
All right, that is good, that is done. All right, confused, and then two encounter cards. First one is, don't care, misled, shuffle this card, gain surge, into the advance for four. So that goes to seven. Misled goes into my deck. All right, Wolverine heals for one. Storm's gonna heal to go to seven. Man, we have a lot of good stuff here. All right, we're gonna flip up. Uh, we're gonna change the weather into the thunderstorm. Uh, we'll deal two damage. He is down to six. We will ready with our thing. All right. We will... I think we'll just lightning bolt here and finish it. All right, death focus. Uh, yeah, uh, we'll use X gene and a strength to do a lightning bolt. <laughs> so we're taking him out. Avalanche is gone. Uh, we each get an encounter card. Uh, and then I resolve this. I think I'll just do. Uh, I'll just do two damage on her, and then we get one of the other villains. Is this the villain? Where's the villain? I have Blob and Pyro. Where's my other villain? Oh, it's Toad. All right. So at that okay. So technically, this goes like this. All right. So let's see which one's the next guy. All right, we got Blobbers. All right, Blobbers has 38 health. And he gets a tough. All right, so we each get it. That's our encounter cards. Okay, good. And we did our two damage here. Uh, we are going to use her crown. Oh, we did change the weather. Oh, yeah. Uh, so we are attacking for four, right? So Wolverine is going to take two and slash for six, taking Blob down to 32. He's done. Uh, Storm is going to... Oh, no, I did ready already. I did ready. Storm is going to punch for four. 32 is going to bring him down to 28. It's going to go fast. I'm going to keep Throg. I have an Into the Fray. Yeah, let's just do it now. Uh, all right, I'm going to go 1, 2, 3, Into the Fray. Uh, that is 6 damage. But because of this, I'll do 5 Overkill. So remove 5 Threat. She's out. I have a weather goddess if I want to change the weather after, which I will. Uh, and then rogue is tough and she needs to go touch on one. All right, rogue is going to touch a blobbers. All right, uh, I'm going to spend the queen carrier to play an endurance here so she can go up to 10. All right, I think I'm just playing the symbiote suit. Yeah, I think I am just going to do that. So I'm going to use uh, X-Jet, Clea, and a Strength symbiote suit. I go to 17. And then I'm going to use Martial Prowess, Death Focus. And I will do a Southern Cross. For I have, I don't have Stalwart, but I do have Retaliate. I don't have Aerial. So I'm going to deal 6 damage and stun the enemy. So 6 damage, he's down to 22. And then I am punching for 
wait, I'm punching four. Three, three, four, five. Punching for five, he's down to 17. That's very quick. Yeah, these villains are not going to last very long. Uh, Storm's going to change the weather. And we're going to put it into the hurricane. And we'll move the last two threat from the main. All right. Oh, my God. This is beautiful. All right. Two, three, four, five. All right. We got the bulletproof bell again. So two, three, four, five, six, seven cards. <laughs> Don't forget, Steve. You get seven cards. You are symbi symbiotized rogue uh, as the sorceress supreme. So seven cards. So just like Iron Man. And then Storm is up. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, nice. We got this, the marked weather. Storm's not going to do much this turn, but it's okay. It's all right. Uh, adding three threat to the main. He is stunned versus her. Blob's going to get attacked into Rogue for a bunch. Removes the tough. Retaliate two. One for his, one because I'm touching the villain. And then one, two, three cards. All right, let's see what we got. First one is exhaustion and a surge, of course, into under siege. There's only blob, so that's three threat. Next one is nothing surge into another attack. Uh, Rogue is going to use Death Focus to do Bulletproof Bell. I'll prevent all the damage. Retaliate 2, 13, gain a tough and draw an extra card because of the unflappable. We get Harpoon that does nothing. Hopping Mad, get the Toad. Where's Toad? There he is. And then a gang up. Yay. So Blob's going to have taken a ton of damage just because of us. Uh, so he's going to attack us again for a bunch. We'll lose our tough. Retaliate two down to one. Uh, he's going to attack us. We're just going to defend. Oh, actually... And after damage the character, I don't want to discard. You know what? I don't want to discard cards. So I'm just going to defend, and then he's going to take retaliate too. All right. And passing it over here. Okay. Rogue is 100% playing one and Polaris for Utopia. And then I am going to I'm gonna to go touch the villain again. I'm gonna go one, two, three. I'm gonna go one, two, three to play Joe Costa, bring back bulletproof bell under her. Uh, and then I'll use the X-Jet to play an unflappable here. I have too many resources, not a lot of things to do. If I play an X-Men, I could ready. I don't have one. I'd rather have that. Okay, so what are we doing, Steve? Uh, she can just punch for one, get rid of Toad. And she'll take one. And then she can block for someone. All right. Uh, Storm. Stormy Warmy is going to heal Wolverine. Two will put a follow through ear. Um, we will use Marked and Storm to play a martial prowess on ourselves. All right. So we have all the resources. We have everything we need. Uh, we are going to change the weather into the thunderstorm again we'll deal two damage here 
Uh, Wolverine will take two and attack for six. Oh yes, Storm gets to ready as well. So attacks for six, killing Harpoon. Um, then he's exhausted. Uh, and can she can she can attack for four? Yeah, well, let's just do that. And she'll attack for four, bringing him down to seven. All right, so we're going to be one more turn away, and then we'll be able to get rid of all of them. All right, so that's going to be our second one down. Five cards, one, two, three, four, five. All right, so we have our Blast of Wind, Torrential Rain. We're adding two threat to the main, so that goes to five. Rogue has seven cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> There's our med team, and we get an extra card. So we're gonna get four cards with Rogue, but Rogue doesn't matter, she's just omnipotent right now. <laughs> I love Rogue. Don't you love Rogue? All right, and then, so there's our decks. Uh, he has to damage characters, they're not damaging nobody. Oh, and I can still change the weather, but do I want to? I could change the weather one more time. Yeah, let's just change the weather into uh, the blizzard. So he's attacking for even less. Let's change it to the blizzard. All right, so two accelerations. So that's going to go to nine, which is pretty scary. I got to I gotta take care of that. Uh, Rogue's going to get attacked. I'm going to use X-Gene, Bulletproof Bell. Uh, I'm going to prevent all the damage and he's going to attack for whatever. If this villain is pyro, so he'll take a damage, retaliate down to six. I draw an extra card. It's another bulletproof bell. All right. Uh, Rogue is going to defend. Yeah, Rogue's just going to defend. She's defending for three now. And he's attacking for one. <laughs> yeah, and she, oh no, he's attacking for two. And I'm defending for one, two, three. So I lose my tough, retaliate, down to five. And then one card, two cards, three cards. Let's start the first one. Uh, I will study character I control because there's only one. Double under fire because 10 cards is not enough. Groundswell, go find Avalanche. Is he here? Is he there? Where is the Avalanche guy? There he is. Then we get Shadow of the Past, which will surge. Then we get Immovable. He wants to attack us again. We're going to use this to play the other Bulletproof Bell. Uh, he's attacking us for whatever. Retaliate. And then next card is Immovable. He's attacking us again. For plus two. Uh, I'll remove my tough. Take a Retaliate. He's down to three. <laughs> She's just Invincible Rogue. The Invincible Rogue. And then caught off guard. And we're just laughing here. Uh, cut off guard. I think we're going to lose the... I think just a death focus can go at this point. Yeah, it's it's not really doing much. Okay. Uh, Stormy Warmy's turn. Uh, Wolverine's going to heal for one. He's down to six. Uh, we're going to mark Avalanche. Uh, Storm is going to thwart for two off the main. Uh, I'm going to change the weather into the hurricane. And that's going to remove two threats. Let's just remove two threat here. Storm gets ready. Uh, I am going to use... X-Gene and my crown for two. 
I'm going to do tor Torrential Rain. And that is going to remove three threat from under siege. And then resolve this to bring that down to three. All right, now he has Retaliate. It's a superpower. Okay, so I have two. I only have two resources. I'm short one. Again. Again, I'm short one. All right, I'll be able to discard the misled. Uh, I think Storm can just remove two threat. That's enough. Wolverine can slash uh, for four, five. Oh, and then we kill him. Uh, so punch for three with this guy because he hasn't done anything else. Yeah, so he's punching for three, dying. Uh, Rogue is stunned. Oh, shoot. Rogue is going to go touch Storm and be stalwart. All right. Then I'm going to use Death Focus and the X-Jet to do an energy transfer. I'm going to go touch the villain. Oh, yes. Heal up and deal two damage and then heal for two, go to 19. This is all on hero actions. Okay, Wolverine takes two, slashes through Blob, and Blob is out. And then Avalanche is out. And then I'm touching nobody. And then we each get an encounter card. And who's the next guy? Who is the next guy? Pyro Man. All right, Pyro Guy. He's tough. And victory. Okay. So we need to kill one more guy, and then we're good. But we're going to kill both of them. Okay, so we're going to pass it back. Uh, so I do have Retaliate. I do have Aerial. And I'm no longer stalwart, so I don't get to draw cards anymore. All right. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Uh, I want to do the specialized training, but I don't think I need it anymore. Uh, Jocasta is going to punch and die. Get rid of the tough. I'm going to spend three to do a med team. I'm going to heal Wolverine for two. So we can keep him in the fight a little bit longer. I'm not, I want to do the specialized training, but I think I'm just going to avoid it. I'm going to, I'm not touching anyone. Rats. I'm just punching for three now. And he's got 34. All right, 34. I'm going to punch for three. Take him down to 31. I do take a retaliate, 18. And I'm going to martial prowess with a southern cross. Uh, so that is going to stun him. Because I have retaliate because of the dauntless. Uh, I do have aerial, so I'm going to deal 8 damage. And I'm not Star Lord. So 8 is going to bring him down to 23. 31 minus 8 is 23. And I take a Retaliate. I don't, I don't get to draw an extra card. All right. And he got stunned. So we are good. All right. I'll get rid of the Blast of Wind. I think we're good here. Uh, two, four, five. I'll keep that specialized training. One, two, three, four, five, six, two, four, six, and seven. Oh, we are definitely getting that specialized training down. All right. Adding uh, one, two, three. So that's four threats on the main. 
Stunned versus Storm. Uh, and then attacking into Rogue. Who's going to defend? For three, he's attacking for one, for two, three, four. So I will take a damage, go down to 15, 16. I do retaliate down to 22. And then I'll take two indirect and go down to 14. All right, encounter, encounter, encounter. Right. First one is protect the students, six threats and a crisis. Second one is misled. Uh, it's gonna shuffle in my deck and surge into mutant terrorist. Uh, go get the brotherhood side scheme again. More cards, more cards, more cards. Where's the Brotherhood? Is it still here? No. Oh, that means it's a face down encounter card. Ah, oh, that's sad. So what does it do if I don't get it? Uh, side scheme and reveal it. If it did not enter this play, discard cards from the top until a Brotherhood minion is discarded and reveal it. Is there a Brotherhood left? Brotherhood of Mutants. Is that the one? A oh, Brotherhood minion. Yeah, that is going to be Mystique coming in. Then there it is. And then Arc Lights. And Mystique comes in with a tough. All right, passing it over here. Sixth threat is already done. Seventh threat on this. All right. Uh, passing over here. Oh, no. Passing it over to... All right. Rogue. Rogue is going to go touch someone. All right. First things first. We're going to use Queen Carrier. We're going to play <coughs> Specialized Training with 10th threat on it. All right, I'm going to go touch Storm, and I'm going to use Superpower. Oh, do I want to use Superpower Adaptation? Or do I just want to touch the villain? No, I want to have, I want to have Ariel. Yeah, I want to have Ariel. All right, so I'm going to touch Storm, uh, and now I have Ariel. And I still have Retaliate, so I'll be able to confuse. Uh, I'm going to use X-Gene, Death Focus. I'm going to do Going Rogue. I'll remove 5 Threat from Specialized Training. I'm going to use 2 for Going Rogue. Oh, I, I get to confuse an enemy, so I'm going to confuse Pyro. And then I'll remove another 5 Threat from Specialized Training. <coughs> uh, yeah, so that's done. Uh, then we each go get something. So I'm going to go get the frontline specialist. Get plus four hit points. Go to 18 again. Whenever I take damage. Uh, and then Storm can go get the surveillance specialist. Uh, then I'm going to do is I'm going to spend X-Jet. Superpower Adaptation Energy Transfer for three. I'm going to play Nightcrawler, which is going to ready Rogue. All right. And then Nightcrawler can remove two threat from the Brotherhood. Take a hit. Med Team can heal Wolverine. And Rogue is now... Oh, we can change the weather. Oh, I, why do I have this card here? Uh, so I think I go have to go get Avalanche. I forgot to resolve Storm's card. So Avalanche. And then I think that would have happened before the... I forget. Oh, because I had under fire. So I think Avalanche is just here. And then he would have exhausted a character and dealt me three damage, 15, and I would have dealt one damage to him because of the retaliate. I think that would have been, that's pretty much where we would have been. 
Okay. Okay. So we have lightning bolts galore. All right, we need to remove some threat. And then she gets the plus one thwart, right? So she's thwarting for three now and drawing cards. Okay, uh, Wolverine healed. So I think he's at one. I can't remember if I did it or not. I don't think it matters. Uh, but I am going to uh, thwart for three off of protect the students. So that's going to go down to three. I am then going to change the weather into the thunderstorm. I'll deal two damage to Avalanche. I get to ready. Uh, because I thwarted, I get to draw a card. It's misled. Uh, two threat go on the main. I'm going to remove three more threat off protect the students. I go get an ally. Uh, this is all here. I don't know why it's done. I'll look for my deck for an ally. There's another misled in here. Rats. All right, it's going to be uh, the Frogman. Okay. I have a Lightning Bolt, a Flash Freeze into the fray. All right, I am going to use the Crown and the Garden. I'm going to play Throg. Wolverine is going to slash for six into Mystique, taking her out. I am going to spend a Power of Aggression and a Mental Prowess, Martial Prowess. I'm going to do Into the Fray. Uh, that is going to do two here. And I'm going to excess for four, five, six. So get rid of all the threat off the main. Right then, I have a flash freeze and a misled. What do I want to do? Um, don't much. I'm gonna punch for four on arc light. Oh yes, retaliate. Hmm. I'm gonna punch for four off the villain. He's down to eighteen. All right. And he'll take a damage. Okay. And we have Pyro Confused. I think she is going to flip down. Storm is going to flip down. And if I would have done that, I would have kept my garden. And then spent something else. And then use the Flash Freeze to play the garden and heal for two. Go to 12. And then I'll just discard Misled. Alright, so... Taking an encounter card, two, four, five, putting two threat because of the misled. Alright, it's almost over, baby. So close. This is the end. My friend. Alright, two, four, five, six cards. Man, I really want to find Storm's attack cards. I just can't find them. It's so sad. Uh, and then Storm can just take, discard some cards and get dealt damage. But Rogue is just shining here. Rogue is the, the jewel point of what's going on in this game right now. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Taking a counter card so she would get hers first. Alright, so we're playing Heroic here. And look, all the allies. <laughs> all my allies are there. So one turn of events, one turn of allies. There we go. All right, we're getting, yeah, we're getting a bunch of encounter cards this time. All right, here we go. We're adding three threat, so that is going to go to five. We still haven't went through the deck twice yet. Uh, Pyro wants to attack us. Uh, you know what? Let's just put the Throg in front, the Troganator. All right, Trog's out, and then two cards, so two damage to her, down to ten. Confused. Oh, yes, but her... Confuse the character you control. I'll just get confused. Uh, I'll confuse Nightcrawler. And she's attacking for two. I'll go down to 13. 
I still have retaliate. So one damage here. Okay, then one, two, three, four cards because we have the symbiote suit in here. So three cards each. Bound by business. Oh, and there is one left. Uh, then we get hopping mad. We go get toad and then protect the students. Where is the toadster? I know I saw him two seconds ago. There we go. So he's done. He's done. Six threat on the students. All right, double acceleration. All right, we're going to clean house and then we're going to finish this game. This Pyro at 18, that means there's only Toad left. And that's going to be it. That's only uh, like 30 damage. All right, let's see what she gets. Pyro, we'll find Pyro. Uh, Brotherhood Beatdown and Riptide. All right, so we'll go get Pyro. So much, so much searching in the deck. Uh, pyro, Pyro, Pyro. And then... Oh, so Pyro... Oh, no, Pyro will activate. Oh, so technically he's not doing this. So Brotherhood Beatdown, we have Toad, so I'll have to discard a card at random. And Pyro is also going to activate. So let's do the... Let's do Pyro Activates first for three. So let's kind of go to eight. And then, then I do the Brotherhood Beatdown, which is take two indirect, discard a random card. So go down. Oh, I'm just going to stay to 10 because I'm going to heal and then discard a random card. Please be the misled. Uh, let's go here. It's my double, of course. No. All right, whatever. Fine. Passing it over here. Uh, she's already healed. All right. Wolverine heals. Right. Let's flip up. Storm towards for three. That goes down to three. She draws a card. There. Lose a double, gain a double. Um, I need to kill. I need to kill a kill a kill. All right. I am going to change the weather. No, I'm not changing the weather yet. Do I have anything that I want to do? I have Relentless Assault, Blast of Wind. All right, let's 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 start doing some damage here. Okay, one, two. X-Jet and Martial Prowess for... No. Storm's Crown and Martial Prowess for two. Relentless Assault. Uh, I'm going to deal five damage. Uh, let's do three on Toad. And two, three, four on the villain. Down to 14. Toads out, and this is done. All right. Uh, Wolvie, Wolvie, Wolvie is going to slash and dash. Uh, he's going to slash for six, taking care of Riptide. All right. Then we are going to spend two for a three for a blast of wind. I'll deal, I'll choose a, a player. I'll choose. Rogue, uh, choose a player, deal three damage to the villain and each minion engage with that player. Uh, so that's 11. So that's three, and there one, one's down to one. Um, I will change the weather. Oh yeah, and then the thunderstorm deals two damage. Uh, let's deal two more damage here. So that takes it out and then we'll change the weather to the hurricane we ready with our cape remove two threat we'll remove two from here so that goes down to three we're then gonna thwart for three off the brotherhood uh, that's done and then oh I was gonna do into the fray but I can't I'm short of resource no Rats. Am I really short of resource? I am. Rats.
that. Okay. Uh, so that's all been done. It's all been done. Oh, and I can't. Okay, leave this here for three. Let's remove the crisis instead, which allows me to go get an ally, which is going to get Throg. There we go. Now we have enough. And then we're going to go one, two, three into the fray. So one, and I'm doing five, six, seven in excess. Too bad I didn't have the marked. And then that got away, and then I'm getting rid of misled. That's all done. All right, good turn, Ro. A uh, good turn, Storm. Good, good turn. She cleaned house. All right. Uh, yeah. Rogue. Rogue is gonna go touch. Who's what is Rogue touching right now? Rogue is gonna touch Storm again. Yeah, Rogue is gonna touch Storm. I still have Retaliate, so that's great. I have all three now. I have Ariel, Stalworth. All right, so I'm gonna thwart for three off of this. And I think I forgot to draw when I took damage. Or did I take any damage? Yeah, I did forget to take... I did. I was dealt combat damage. I did forget to draw. All right. Um, I'm going to spend two and the Queen Carrier for three. I'm going to play Polaris. Uh, I'm going to ready because of Utopia. And I'm going to give Storm a tough status card. All right, uh, then I am going to X Gene, Death Focus, Martial Prowess, and I am going to Southern Cross. I will deal eight damage, stun, and draw a card. So that is going to go down to three. I'm going to stun him, doesn't matter. I get to draw a card, but I do take a retaliate, go down to 12. All right. I am then going to um, have Polaris. No, I'm gonna Rogue is gonna punch for three and defeat Pyro. So now technically we win the game here, and then we only need to do 32 damage. We get encounter card, encounter card. All right. I have, what do I have left? All right, uh, Polaris is going to punch, get rid of this, take a retaliate. What do we have here? Do I have a thunderstorm? No. I just have a blast of wind. Darn it, I wish I had the lightning strike. All right, whatever. Uh, let's let's do this again. Let's have some fun. Uh, let's do a Southern Cross. One, two, three. Yeah, one, two. Yeah. We'll keep Brother Voodoo. We'll go one, two, three. We'll keep Superpower Adaptation. We'll do another Southern Cross. Actually... Yeah, we'll keep Clea. And we'll use Superpower Adaptation. We're going to do uh, Southern Cross. We'll deal 8 damage. 32 minus 8 is 24. I'll take a Retaliate, go down to 11. I still have Retaliate, so I will stun him. Uh, tick -a -tick -a -tick, and I will draw a card. Honorary X-Men. Sweet. Uh, 8 damage, tower draw card. Alright, and then I'm going to spend 2. I'm going to play Clea. And that's just a blocker. Uh, she's a, Oh, she's attacking for 2, but would retaliate. Hmm. I still have to discard cards when he deals damage to me. Uh, do we go down? Do we go down? Maybe, instead of playing Clea, I kept my going rogue. And I would done going rogue instead, removing five threat. Uh, and confusing. So he would be stunned and confused. Uh, rogue can go down. 
There you go. And then we'll just finish it next turn. Stun confused. And then he doesn't matter. All right, unless I'm super, super unlucky here and he schemes like five times, uh, I'm, I should be good. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, we have the marked. One, two, four, five. Six, two, four, six. Oh, we got all bulletproof bells. All right, so we're going to rely on Storm to kill. Uh, adding four threats. Two and two is four. Stun Confuse does nothing. Uh, and then one, two, and three. First one is Master Plan. We're going to find a side scheme. Uh, there's not a lot. There's the Protect the Students, but I think I've seen the most of them. Well, there goes all the advances. All right, there you go. Siege with three. Next. Uh, misled uh, when defeated, we don't care. And then surge into, whoops, Brotherhood Beatdown, discard a random card storm. Yay. <laughs> it's my end of the fray. Hey. I get immovable, get blob, and bound by business. So I think I saw blob two seconds ago. Yeah, there he is. And then bound by business is going to get... Great crow. All right, done. So we have the mark. We have a light. Oh, we have the lightning bolt. Yes. All right, passing it over to Rogakins. Rogue's going to flip up, go touch storm. And uh, I'm going to use a storm to change the weather. All right, we got thunderstorm coming out. Deal two damage to blob. Actually, uh, yeah, Blob's Guard. Um, I'm going to punch for, for four, taking out Blob. I'm going to spend Death Focus X Gene. Um, wait, first, I'm going to use Superpower Ad. Oh, no, I can't. Yes, I can. Call for an action. Uh, Storm's Crown, Martial Prowess, and X Gene for three. Lightning Bolt, <laughs> 10 damage. Down to 14. There we go. And then we're gonna mark this guy. Oh no, we can't mark him. We'll just mark him on our turn. Then Rogue is going to use Superpower Adaptation because she's touching him. Touching me, touching you. And we're going to spend three. Actually, we're going to spend one and two. We're going to do the Lightning Bolt, uh, which is going to do 10. He's down to four. Um, she's punching for four, killing him. What a cleanup. Uh, we're going to... Heal Wolverine for two. We're going to use Bulletproof Bell and this. We're going to do an energy transfer. We're going to ready Rogue. Heal her for two. Deal two. So much cleanup. We're going to thwart uh, for three off the Mystiques. No, we're not going to do that. We're going to get rid of this one first. So we're done. We're not too bad. We, we ended up with one side scheme only. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. We're going to mark nobody because I killed everyone. <laughs> All right. So Storm's going to uh, thwart for three for one. Gets the draw card. It's a torrential rain. No. Well, might as well use it. We're going to overspend. Um... Just remove half the threat, it's one. One left, and then Wolverine is gonna slash for six, taking out Toad. Booyah! And this was a pretty long game, but I also killed all four of these guys because they pissed me off and they deserved to die. 
So I hope you enjoyed this long game, but man, oh man, Rogue and Storm, damn, this is such a good combination. Uh, just being able to steal the cards, and Rogue got set up so quickly, it wasn't even funny. It was just like, yeah, I can, I'm can. i stalwart, I'm steady, I'm doing things. And that's the whole point, right? To give her the all three traits. So when she's touching Storm, she's already stalwart and uh, flying and retal and then with the retaliate so she's steady stop and, and steady and what's it called uh where's that touched where did i touch that guy i forget where i put it i can't see where i oh there it is yeah so uh, i villain i get to retaliate as long as i have retaliate aerial and stalwart uh those are what these cards care for so the going rogue and the the southern cross so aerial so that's eight damage stun and draw card and when you can trigger all three all the time it's so good it's so good all right a little bit of work but hey all good things demand effort so i hope you enjoyed this game and this rematch and i hope you enjoyed and remember to subscribe like the channel blah 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 all that kind of cool stuff remember to have some fun and just play the game Peace out.